Yo, what is up guys? Mr. The Reverts here, welcome back to the channel. Today, I wanna to talk to you guys about a bunch of news regarding Warzone Season 5 and the new faction called the Shadow Company, some personal information and news I think you guys may be interested in, and rumors regarding Call of Duty 2020 and the potential reveal coming up. So we got a lot of stuff to talk about here, and let's go ahead and dive into it. So guys, really quick, I wanted to say thank you all so much for the birthday love I received over on Twitter and in my live stream yesterday. Um, if you didn't know, I turned 23 on the 29th, which is absolutely crazy to think about. I think the last time I posted a video talking about my birthday, I believe it was eight years ago, and I was like 15, so that's pretty crazy to think about that I've somewhat documented my life all the way from when I was a little kiddo in high school to me being this grown-ass adult now. Pretty crazy stuff. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for the birthday love, and yes i did say streams i have been live streaming over on twitch and youtube so if you guys want to go check that out the twitch stream is going to be down below in the description i don't really have a set schedule right now i kind of stream like every other day or every day if i don't upload a video then i'll stream for like a couple hours out of the day so um definitely recommend you guys come into those streams it's funny we have a good time playing some Warzone. and if you guys want to inter interact with me then you can do so in those streams um but i would recommend also following me in my discord channel a link to that's going to be down below as well um you can be notified there when i post uh, when i upload videos and stream and just have like a conversation with me there too so um again all the links are going to be down below in the description for that but now moving on to some warzone news guys today we got the trailer for the rise of the shadow company which is supposed to be a new faction in call of duty modern warfare so far we only have two which are the coalition and the allegiance but now it does look like we're going to be getting a third one called the shadow company which are apparently Apparently from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and the campaign of that game there um, but yeah I'm gonna leave a link to the full trailer down below in the description it's also gonna be playing on screen for you guys right now and there's also gonna be a link that Activision posted on their blog that kind of goes into more details about the uh, shadow company and their leaders and a couple of uh, descriptions about the two little members that they have so far in the faction so um, the first one that we have here is gonna be the main um, I guess the leader of the shadow company and his name is Lurch and he hails from Plano, Texas and is a former military member of the US Marine Corps and uh, he's known on the battlefield for his enthusiasm and success in regards to eliminating the enemy. The next member we have is Velkin and not much is known about Velkin but he's dressed in full body armor to protect him in battle and to hide his identity and again little is confirmed about this operator and then lastly we have Rose or Roslyn Helms and uh, Roslyn Helms joined the Shadow Company after migrating from the Allegiance faction Jackals and previously Rose cut ties with the armed services and returned to support her family and ailing father so that has a pretty cool little story for this operator and again the links for the, the full article is going to be down below in the description guys so we do have a new faction called the Shadow Company very very cool very mysterious and I can't wait to learn about more information about the Shadow Company so um, again and links are all going to be down below in the description. And then next up, guys, I want to talk about Warzone Season 5. If you all didn't know, it's going to be coming out officially confirmed on August the 5th. So in about six days, five to six days, um, we're going to be getting a uh, release for the new season. And I absolutely cannot wait, guys. I've actually been kind of um, bored of Warzone so far because not much has been happening within the game itself. But in Season 5, we are going to be getting a functioning train system that we can possibly loot and hopefully even control it in terms of the direction and where the train makes it stops at i think that would be really really cool but now i want to show this clip i found over on twitter from steven who was live streaming the other day and within his game his map was glitching out to show that all the trees in verdansk had just disappeared and the land and the scenery just looked so desolate like a desolate wasteland and what a few people within the call of duty community are thinking is maybe this is going to be a little bit of a hint on the possible new verdansk map after the nuke is launched and it hits and, and just destroys the map. So that could be um, something there. I mean, we do see the, the nuke again in the Shadow Company trailer. So I'm pretty sure at some point it's going to be launching. But now I'm not sure if they are going to make that event happen at the very start of Season 5. I think they definitely want to promote that a little bit more. And maybe even do some more in-game Easter eggs like we saw with the evacuation sign in progress. Um, I think they want to do something more with that. Promote it a little bit just to kind of get the hype up. 
and then lead off into this in-game live event for uh, the Verdansk map. Hopefully that's what they're going to be doing, um, but as of now, we don't really know much about the in-game event. We don't really know much about the nuke in general, um, but definitely, guys, if I find any more information about this, I'll be sure to keep you guys updated, and uh, so yeah, it's coming up, guys, very, very soon here, Season 5, with the nuke launching, and uh, within that, I'm pretty sure we are going to be getting a possible reveal for Call of Duty 2020, which is rumored to be Black Ops Code War. Sony is also rumored to have their state of play address on August the 6th, which is the day after Season 5 is supposed to be revealed, so um, maybe they could do something to tie into that. Maybe they could give, a, give us a little bit of a teaser um, the day Season 5 launches for Call of Duty 2020, and then maybe the next day reveal like a little trailer for uh, Black Ops Cold War. Who knows? Um, but yeah, I would keep an eye out for um, next week because definitely we got Season 5 coming up and then maybe even some more information about Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. I mean, like, I just don't see um, Treyarch and Activision waiting that much longer to reveal this game. Like, we are already in August. It's just crazy because the game for Call of Duty 2020 is supposed to even come out within a couple months. So I do not see them waiting much longer. Next week has to be the week we get something. Um, but yeah, guys, really quick too, going back to the Shadow Company trailer, we got a look at two new weapons coming, the AN-94, which is an assault rifle, and the APC-9, which is a compact SMG. A lot of people are kind of upset that we're going to be getting another AR and SMG, but personally, I could care less. The Intervention Snipe Rifle has been found within the game's files, but we don't know much else about that or know anything further than uh, that, the, that the gun is actually in the files. It could be coming in Season 5, it could be coming at a later day uh, within Season 5, but yeah, the intervention is found within the files. But yeah, guys, next week is going to be a very, very crazy week in terms of Call of Duty content. I'm going to be streaming a majority for that week as well, so uh, make sure you stop by for that and come say hi, and also join the Discord for more information with, uh, you know, streaming and when I upload that kind of stuff. And yeah, comment down below your thoughts about Warzone Season 5, and if you happen to see anything else in that Season 5 Shadow Company trailer. Thanks so much for watching. Love you all so, so much. Have a great rest of the day. Till next time, I'll see you later.